When I'm getting ready for a race, there's a lot to prepare for. I have enough to worry about. But I never worry about my oil. My sled's ready. Is yours? Welcome back to Sledhead 24-7, everyone. This is your Snowmobile Connection. We are coming to you from the Polaris World Headquarters just outside of Minneapolis. Right now, we're going to take a good hard look at two different sleds from our friends north of the border. These are two new concepts that really push the sled technology outside of the box in the snowmobile industry. Hold on to your seats, ladies and gentlemen. You are about to get aced. This year, the folks at Skidoo have broken new trail under the hood. Evolving and engineering new Rotex power plants. Pick your flavor, two stroke or four. They've got the engine to match your mood. And today, Sledhead 24 7 has an all access, all trail pass to the latest ins and outs of Skidoo's new sleds. And Paul Mack drew the lucky assignment. I'm here with Gordy Radke from Skidoo, and we've got a revolutionary new four stroke engine called the 600 Ace, and Gordy is going to walk us through it and tell us about it, Gordy. Well, first of all, this engine is designed as a fan-cooled replacement. It's an extremely efficient twin-cylinder four-stroke engine. It's a dual overhead cam, parallel twin. It's a very heavy-duty valve train, a cam chain with self-adjusting cam chain adjuster. We have an oil tank integrated right into the engine block, so it's excellent for cooling. It was designed for no maintenance for the life of the engine. It has a very simple cartridge oil filter that gets changed once a year. And over here we look at the unique intake plan on it. It has a single 46 throttle body. It has a very unique tuned intake track that gives you actually over 100% volumetric efficiency in the mid throttle range. Excellent gas mileage, 30 to 35 miles per gallon. More miles per gallon means more seat time and a thicker wallet. Who's not a fan of that? Now the Mac man has moved up the mountain and is meeting with another mega mine from Skidoo. We've got Dominic Godbout from BRP. He's in the marketing department. He's going to tell us what's new with the Skidoo free ride because we've been riding it now for about two hours and this thing is ultra cool. So Dominic, if you can tell us about it, start at the front and walk us back through it. All right, well, it's brand new for 2011 and it's essentially a sled in which we regroup everything that we have, the best from, uh, from all of the uh, Bombardier parts. So we start with uh, new skis in the front. Uh, the front suspension is adjustable, the best KYB shocks uh, that we make. And then as you move on down, I mean, it's a new rear skid that we've just uh, come out with this year. The uh, rear arm is pushed back uh, 4.5 inches. It's much more comfortable and it, um, and it controls the transfer also uh, much better. And then inside the engine compartment, we have the new 800 E-Tech, develops 160 horsepower plus. Good fuel economy, about 19 miles a gallon. And uh, also when it comes to oil, very low uh, oil consumption. Rounding out the Mac Man's journey, yet another discovery on how to be king of the hill. Now we're going to talk about the Skidoo Summit X. Dominic is going to tell us what's new for 2011. Well, essentially we, we started to change the, uh, the configuration of the suspensions in 2010. And what we did in 2010 is we put a new rail, we have a new longer shock, limiter strap is longer. And then what we did for 2011 is we built up on that. We modified the front suspension, it's narrower. It's essentially uh, adjustable from uh, 36 to uh, 38 inches. There are new skis for uh, 2011. Uh, the lips are smaller, so you can go on your side much easier. They cut through the snow gives you a much better control. They're large, good flotation. So all around that, uh, we've improved the ski and it's very good when you want to wound dock and you want to swing the machine from one side to the other. So let's talk about the engine. Once again, we've got the fantastic power in the 800 E-Tech. Yeah, the 800 E-Tech is uh, brand new for this year. It's a great engine, it works very well. And if you look at the pod on the side of the machine, you can see that we've put some new air intakes now so that when you go boondocking in, in very deep powdery snow, you, uh, you don't get any blockage on the intake anymore. Skidoo Summit Mountain Sleds are known throughout the land as being some of the best deep snow machines around. And now the Mac Man is a believer. Boy, they were wrapping it up here. If you want to get to the local Skidoo dealer and check these out, you are going to be so amazed at the new Skidoo Summit X with the 800 E-Tech, the new Skidoo Freeride with the 800 E-Tech. These things are so trick. If you want to be the baddest guy in the mountains, 
this is what you have to have. Get over to your ski -Doo dealer and check it out, or you can go to www.skidoo.com. And I want to thank Dominic for giving us all the information on these, because it was very helpful, and he is the information king. It's a pleasure. Thank you very much. Thanks so much, Mac Man. Looks like you're having fun up there. And as far as you, my little sassy sledder, stay right where you are. Sledded 24-7 is coming right back. And as I say in Swedish, vi kommer strax tilbake, kompisar. When Sledhead 24-7 returns, the wild woods of Wisconsin are calling. Fly like an eagle to a time-honored tradition and party down at a weekend you don't want to miss. We'll have your travel itinerary for a race weekend going on four decades plus. 